Coach Calipari had nosebleed seats to watch his team tonight in the Bahamas. All right, that's just really about five rows back at the Imperial Ballroom Court in Atlantis. The Wildcats also wore those black uniforms while taking on the Bahamas national team. And how about these two returners, Nick Richards with the block. P.J. Washington runs the break, finds Richards for the slam. He led UK with 20, or with rather 19 points. Washington later got his chance to finish the break with a jam of his own. He had 12 in the game. And then how about how good Nick Richards looked on the offensive end? Look at this soft shot here, little half hook. UK led it 13 to nothing at one point. And then it was the incoming freshman that kind of took over, Tyler Hero off the bench. Look at the step back for the mid-range jumper. Ashton Hagens is going to have a steal just kind of land right in his lap, but it's what he does with it afterwards. The speed that he takes it to the other end, the spin move. He had seven points, five rebounds, three steals. And Travis Reed, well, he got it going late in the game off the rebound. He had 14 of them. Scores here for two of his eight. Kelvin Johnson gets out in transition, misses the first time, but gets the rebound in the putback. He had 11 points and seven rebounds in the game. And how about the coach's son? Brad Calipari gets in late in this one and gets a chance to knock on a three-point shot. And look at the bounce that he gets on this. Bounce, 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 in. And then Hero finishes it off with a steal and the slam as UK wins 85 to 61 behind the 19 points of Nick Richards. Last year I was a little bit more tentative on offense. You know, I wasn't really trying to look for my shots, but Coach Kyle, you know, in practice he he probably runs. He tells me just don't don't look to pass the ball, just look to score. Um, he's trying to build my, my confidence on offense. Uh, you know, I'm, and you know it's paying off. You can see the results on the court right now. The Cats back on the court tomorrow night against San Lorenzo de Almagro, a team out of Buenos Aires, Argentina. Same time, 7 o'clock on the SEC Network. UK also picked up a commitment today from Khalil Whitney. He's a 6'6 small forward out of New Jersey, the 19th overall player in the 24-7 sports composite rankings, the number five small forward. Whitney joins Allen and uh, Tyrese, and Dante Allen and Tyrese Maxey in the class of 2019. EKU also taking a foreign trip to Costa Rica and head coach A.W. Hamilton's first season. They played Laurentian University out of Canada and Nick Mayo led the way with 22 points, 11 rebounds as the Colonels won 93-83. Let's continue talking high school football season which starts a week from Friday. The Henry Clay Blue Devils 6-6 six and six last season starting slowly but coming on in the end to win four of their last six. Now they're ready to build off that for this season. Last year we finished strong. There was a couple games against some good teams. Douglas, Scott County, we were right there in the end. And so just focusing on the game at hand and, and finishing is kind of the goal for the year. Just finish what we started. We look two or three weeks ahead uh, as a team and try and plan for a team we play two weeks down the road. To this year we're taking it more of a day-by-day, practice-by-practice thing and taking every game as serious as we can. The Legends picked up a second straight win over Asheville with a 4-2 victory on Wednesday, and the Reds fall 8-zip to lose the series in New York to the Mets. LAX 18 News will be right back.